Hi everybody, so I'm back. Today I'm going to just be doing a get ready with me video, but I just wanted to say that I'm very self-conscious about showing my face on camera with no makeup. I have extreme dark circles which are hereditary and they have always made me very self-conscious. So please, if you have anything nasty to say, don't say anything at all. So first I'm just going to take this Clean and Clear Essentials Moisturizer. And if I'm looking down guys, it's just because my mirror is here. Because it's really hot, I'm going to pop on the L'Oreal Infallible Mattifying Base. So the next thing I'm going to use is just this Maybelline cover stick and this is in yellow and it corrects dark circles. How crazy do I look? Just blending this in with my Chi Chi Beauty sponge. I'm just going to be using the Rimmel Lasting Finish nude foundation and this is in a hundred ivory because i am pale i'm just going to dot this all over my face mm, this might be a little bit too pale so i might have to add a darker powder over the top but we shall see so I'd really like it if you guys would leave your channels below so I could check them out. And now I'm just going to add some concealer. I'm just going to use the Fit Me Concealer in Fair. So I do use three concealers guys, I use like the corrector underneath my makeup, then I use this one to kind of brighten, and then I use my Thin Lizzy concealer because it really helps cover. So in the very last concealer I'm just going to take this Thin Lizzy concealer, and this one is in the shade Oriental Doll. So I'm just going to apply that with my Real Techniques concealer brush. And I'm just going to use the designer brand's Firming Age Revive Pressed Powder in the shade 713 Nude Beige. All the writing's coming off because I love this little guy. Okay guys, so next is bronzer. My favourite has been the W7 bronzer and this is the bronzer matte, that's what it's called. And this is like really amazing, it's only $5 and I just really love it for warming up my face. It's not too orange and it's just really beautiful. <laughs> So next I'm going to contour and I'm just using the Pro Contour Palette by Designer Brands. This is a really good palette, I've been liking it and it's only $17. I think this is limited edition though. Everyone's saying that it's a dupe for the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. I can't say if it is or not because I don't have the Kat Von D Palette. So I'm just going to use this shade here for contouring and then a little bit of this shade underneath my eyes. Now I'm just going to take the lighter shade and do underneath my eyes.
So today I'm just going to use the Essence Silky Touch Blush. highlight and I'm just going to use the Prestige Skin Loving Minerals Highlighter in Pure Shimmer. I'm just going to use the Color Drama pencil in pink so chic oh my god how funny does that look oh this smells so good so I'm just going to be curling my eyelashes with this eyelash curler I got from Kmart and I'm just going to be using the Essence Lash Princess Mascara. Okay, so now I'm just going to do my eyebrows and I'm just going to use this Daiso eyebrow pencil that I got from there. Just going to comb out my brows. Yeah, I forgot. I'm just going to put some of my L'Oreal Brow Artist Plumper in my eyes to set them in place all day. This stuff is amazing, you guys. Okay, guys, so this is it. I really hope that you love this look. It was my first, so obviously it's not going to be that good. Thanks for watching guys, please leave any video requests down below and I'll see you next time. Bye!